I just felt my environment wasn't safe um, for me to be in. And Kaylee Humphreys tells us in a CBC News exclusive she no longer feels safe competing for Canada. She's asked to be released from the team, but Humphrey says bobsleigh Canada won't do it. So now she's suing. In court documents obtained by CBC News tonight, Humphreys alleges the organization breached their contract relating to their athlete coach code of conduct. Humphreys filed a harassment complaint last August. She's been waiting for resolution, but has lost patience. There has been no information provided throughout this past year on how I can return to sport. I've asked time and time again what I need to do, um, what would be a safe environment. I would like to come back to a safe environment, be competing for Canada. 1200s on the last run. Humphreys is a three-time Olympic medalist and the only female bobsledder to win back-to-back -back gold medals. So accomplished, she was a closing ceremony flag bearer at the Sochi Olympics. Heartbroken about leaving the country she's accomplished so much for. Um, it's really hard. It's hard. Um, this has been, this has been my life. It's been a 15 year career. This is everything that I dreamed of since I was a kid. And to know that a country has supported me so strongly and the people in the country have been so great. The most dominant female bobsleigh pilot. As for Bobsleigh Canada, in a statement to CBC News tonight, it says it abides by its harassment and discrimination policy that has been in place since 2006. Out of respect to all parties involved, we will not be commenting further on this matter until the process has been completed. So I think, Devin, a lot of Canadians might have a hard time processing this uh, uh, about Kaylee. What happens next? Well, Adrian, for as slow as this process has been to this point, it's escalating. So Humphreys mm -hmm. and her legal team have given Bobsleigh Canada one week to release her from the team. Of course, her citizenship is going to be a big issue in all of this, mm -hmm. but not for very long. This Saturday in San Diego, she's marrying an American, and Adrian, in one week tomorrow, she plans on being in Lake Placid with Team USA. Wow, what a turnaround. Okay, Devin, thank you. You're welcome.